Uh, I know the coach is trying to go into a route where, you know, uh, defense, defense, defense. So uh, with that, you know, that's been my mentality my whole life. It's a pride thing. Bringing youthful energy, Rondé Hollis Jefferson is a versatile wing player who can positively impact both offense and defense. I would say uh, me being defense savvy, <laughs> I always say like I'm a step ahead of my opponent. It's an instinct, you know, just naturally good on defense. Uh, knowing, you know, how to read the play, knowing how to read people's body. There's certain things I pick up on. Me having this mindset, it only, you know, makes the game more competitive, make people turn it up a, a lot more. Um, and then, you know, a lot of guys are be like, oh, he's playing this hard, let me step it up. So now um, they see me get a steal, you know, next time down, another teammate might get a steal. Like the domino effect, you know, it rubs off on guys. And now you got five team members, the whole team playing defense like that. He's been doing a tremendous job of going out there and just being active, being all over the court. He has very, very quick hands. Uh, he's able to you know, maneuver his way into the post and, and get steals and stuff like that. But you know, he's a young player, so sometimes we have to slow him down a little bit. But I think he's, he's been the most impressive one as far as going out there and playing. Laying a strong foundation in training camp bodes well for the season that lies ahead. Coach Hollins stresses the importance of practice and repetition, making it become second nature during games. Our cameras went behind the scenes at training camp in Durham, North Carolina with Coach Hollins and were treated to a nice surprise thereafter. Let's take a look. Let's bring it on, get ready to go to work. You're on the hill so much that it's kind of hard for you to pivot. Right. You know, pivoting is on this here. Now drop, just come right, yeah. You got this guy here, and you're trying to come here and get here. Once you get here, he's cooked because you're big and strong. Right. And now you just go through him. Knowing the guys that are coming back, I think we have seven guys coming back, and knowing them a lot better, all that makes me more comfortable. And having a fairly decent idea about the guys that are coming in, just, again, that will be different because they are new, but some of them I've had a relationships with before. Both of these bigs have the ability to stop right here. He may, he may stop right there and take the shot. So you have to stay and read. Make every good pass, no turnovers. Lay up, follow me and Joe, back to the elbow, Rondé. Whoever's on defense has got to stop the ball. You got to get in front and make the ball change directions. Good execution. Just one year in. I mean, once you've done it once with a group and they've done it once with you, it becomes easier to lay the groundwork and then everything, you know, takes off from there. A little flutter over the top. Get the ball to him so we can run. Go, Dante. Go, Dante. Middle. Go. Lay up. Lead the guy. He's running. Throw it ahead of him. Give some air. Don't throw it behind him and let the defense catch up and block his shot or foul him. So I'd like to you know, be a little bit more up-tempo offensively, better ball movement than we had last year, and uh, ball less sticking, and uh, sharing the ball, playing together, getting up and down the court, not caring who scores, and helping each other on defense and flying around. Some refs will give it to you and some won't. All you have to do is go up and make the guy miss. Keep your feet. Good. Good job. Good job. You're on strong side. He dove. You don't ever chase the ball, right? You should be closing out to him. But when you close out to him, get into him this way and just go. Let him go. Make him go that way. It's about looking out there and seeing what person has what we may need. And if we can get him, can he fit in? And uh, I think that that's, that's how I look at it. All you have to know, if he dribbles at you, we're in roll or rub. T-Rod, would you please shoot the ball? You got both feet in the paint, please shoot the ball. We want to get up and get up and jump up and down and make him throw a lob pass. Good, good. Throw a little higher. Good, good, good. Come on, come on. I guess we're out of time. Good. Yeah, 
the legend says that uh, Kengis Khan and his warriors, uh, they had practiced the skull. Uh, where is the only weapon is your body. The skull teaches us to keep our body in constant stress. At the same time, you keep one muscle tensed and the other are relaxed. It's the state we need to be in during the game when you are shooting at the bottom. If it's easy for you, I will show after advanced version, okay? They are really great athletes. I wanted to say a personal hello to the coaches and to the team and to show my support before the start of the season. All of us, a really great start of the season. I'll be with you. Let's make this year simply outstanding. Let's show the mark of the game this year. Uh, get people talking about us and looking what we do. Let's show them the real magic and put all of this great talent together as a united team.